Hey there, it's Chris here. In a couple of minutes, I'll walk you through jailbreaking the latest version of iOS 18 with no computer involved using the Electra jailbreak. And it's a piece of cake, I promise. So keep your eyes peeled and don't miss a beat. By the end of this video, you'll have a fully untethered Cileo installed on your device, running any version of iOS 18. I'll also show you how to install cool tweaks like getting a very impressive quick launch menu like this, or a cool underdog options like this to speed up your typing experience. Okay, let's get the show on the road. First, let me show you the current iOS version on my iPhone. As you can see, it's the latest version of iOS 18. Let's go ahead and open up Safari browser. Don't use any other browser than Safari. Now, go to this website, jbelectra.com. Be sure to enter the website link correctly. I'll drop this link in the first comment below. Give it a few seconds to load. The site will do some security check. That should be done in a few seconds. All right, so the site has been loaded and this is what it looks like. You can read about the jailbreak down here if you have some time. Otherwise, let's just head towards the jailbreak process. The first step is to jailbreak the iPhone remotely. Then install the Saleo app. So go ahead and click on the proceed button. Now there's a social locker. Since this website offers the jailbreak tool for free, in exchange, you need to complete their sponsored social survey. You can share this site on Facebook or Twitter or subscribe to a YouTube channel. It's your choice. I'll go with YouTube subscription option. So go ahead and click on this little YouTube icon and you'll be redirected to a YouTube channel. Here, just click on the subscribe button. Once you subscribe, make sure to get the notification to all. Once you've done all that, return to the browser and the proceed button should be unlocked Click on it, then it will redirect you to the Electra jailbreak page. Once it's loaded, click on the Start Jailbreak button. I'll start verifying your device and check jailbreak compatibility. Give it a few seconds to scan your device. It'll just speed up through this part. It will confirm you the current iOS version installed on your device. Now just click on Confirm Yourself, then click Close. And click Close one more time. And we're off! Jailbreaking is underway. Just be patient and let it do its thing. I'll fast forward this part too. All right, guys, the jailbreak has been completed. If you've been following along, you should see Saleo being extracted from this app. As you can see, it gives me the option to install Saleo. Go ahead and do that. Saleo is now installing on my iPhone. Give it a moment to complete. There you have it. Saleo is installed on my iPhone. Go ahead and open it. Voila, we've got a fully functional Soleo. As you can see, I'm able to see all the free and paid tweaks here. I'm also able to navigate through different pages. Now it's time for some tweaks. Here I am going to install a tweak called Rune. This tweak will give you a really cool quick launch menu from within any application. Rune attempts to make accessing certain features on your iPhone easier and less cumbersome by introducing an easily invoked interface that can be summoned with a swipe up from either the bottom left or bottom right of your display. Just go ahead and install the tweak. Once installed, you need to respring your device. All right, now just give it a moment to complete the respring process, and there it is. Go ahead and unlock your iPhone. All right, now, when you're within any app, all you need to do is just swipe up from bottom right, and it'll bring in this multi-page menu. You can customize all these pages the way you want. To customize these options, you need to go to Settings, then choose Rune. Here, you will see this Configure Panels section, and here you can customize all the pages. You can choose any apps you want. You can also customize other options, like if you want to change the swipe position from which the drawer might appear, you can choose from here either left side, both sides, or right side from the bottom area. It is really awesome. Now let's move on to another fun tweak. Here I'm going to install a tweak called Underdock. Underdock brings new actions on the keyboard dock view. The native keyboard on iOS provides some fundamental features, but its functionality can be significantly enhanced through jailbreak and the utilization of tweaks like the recently unveiled Underdock. It allows you to place useful actions under your keyboard dock. Just go ahead and install the tweak. After installation, you need to respring your device again. All right, now all you have to do is just go somewhere like this message app and open the keyboard. Here you see a dedicated preference pane has been added to the stock keyboard app. You can do all sorts of things quickly, like easily navigating to the start or end of a text like this, or perform quick copy and paste operation very easily with these options. You can even access the emoji options more quickly. You can also customize these options from settings. Isn't it cool? So this is how you can jailbreak iOS 18, any version, and install some amazing tweaks using Saleo. 
If you bump into any issues, drop me a message in the first comment below and I'll be more than happy to help. But make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel first. Thanks for watching my video. Catch you later.